I just picked up at a chicken place in Hempstead. I'm going to New Hyde Park. The bags are very heavy, so I have my cart. I'm going to have to make two trips, but it's not a lot. $45 payout. That's the place. P-O-L-L-O. -L -L -O. I believe L-L -L is like a J. Pollo. Camparo. The delivery paid $45.71. I got up to the building. It's the building that I delivered to and the same suite that I delivered the $1,200 subtotal of the food last week. That was a big order. I put my flashes on. I parked in the same spot. I made sure that one car can get out plenty of room and I didn't block, completely block the ramp. I had to park in front of the door. I had this on and I had my flashes on and the security car was a few cars down watching me and he left me alone and I was hoping God I hope there's no ticket when I get outside and no ticket on my car but he was watching me he wanted to see what I was doing because you're not supposed to park there it's not really a loading zone but there's no loading zone here and you know I really don't want to walk a quarter of a mile with hot food from the other side of a parking lot I get upstairs, I know exactly the suite, the lunchroom, so I go into the lunchroom and I take the boxes out of the bags, then I went around and I introduced myself and I told them who I was and I said I was here last week and the lady at the desk, there's always one person in every business, she's like, what are you telling us for? Well, because I'm in your building. Unbelievable. Well, I was told that I needed to inform people when I'm in the building and I'm delivering the food. So now I go back to the room and I'm taking out the tins and I'm placing them on the table. And a woman comes in and she goes, you know, this was canceled. Canceled? Now I'm nervous. She goes, can you tell me the name? Can you contact them? Can't ca I couldn't contact them through the app. Um, once the app says I arrived, that option goes away. I can call the office, they see the button, but I couldn't call the person. Maybe if I tapped the button next to the address, maybe the app would have called the person that they say to ask for. But even the woman, when she looked at my phone, it looks like I would call the doctor's office. It didn't seem like it was an option to call the person. I must ask delivered that, that it says to ask for. So I said, okay, have a good day. I got nervous. I came downstairs and went, damn it. I, I didn't take pictures. So I run back upstairs. It's only a two floor building. And when I opened the door, they go, did they give any plates, any silverware? And I was like, no, and I'm happy I came back up. I forgot to take pictures. I did ask, is there ut um, utensils and plates included? And they said, no, some deliveries don't include that. It's gotta be on the receipt. And I did ask that before I left the chicken place and they went, no utensils included. So while I was in the room bringing in the food, right before I went to the desk to inform them that I was there, and that, that, that they had food, a man was in the hallway and he goes, ma'am, can I ask you where that's from? So I tell him, I spell it out for him and I tell him the name and he says, it's a chicken place, it's a Spanish chicken place. And he was like, oh, okay, thank you very much, miss. So there's some kind of confusion there, but I just finished my job, I came downstairs, I was afraid to get a ticket. The security guy didn't bother me. Something, something was not right there. And they weren't angry at me. They were digging in. It's just, I, everybody seemed a little bit like, we, we got food today, Where, where'd this come from? This was canceled. So uh, I'm not sure how they're gonna take care of that, but I did what I was paid to do. And you know, once I got the pictures, I got out of there just to prove that they had the food. So that's what happened. Now I'm gonna head out, it's a beautiful day. Why not work? They sent me this order at 8.30 at night last night. 8.30, this order was sent to me and I accepted it. I was going to go out in the evening, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Okay, so stay tuned. We'll see what the rest of the day brings. I'm going to upload another video speaking about Uber Eats because as the day went on, 
there's a few things to share with you and to keep this video short and on topic delivered and I hope you enjoyed the video and I turned down oh let me show you that delivered just sent me an offer it's for 7 50 a.m. And the drop-off is Adelphi University. And I know where that is. However, a lot of notes. It's a small order, but for 20 bucks, if you want me to set time aside first thing in the morning like that, nah, you can take it. I'm going to give that back. I'm going to decline.